Writer's block. You want the cure? I got the cure. Check this out. So a couple posts back, I wrote something about Dr. Edmund Burglar, who invented the term writer's block. I won't go into it. I don't want to get into it. But I'll tell you that two guys got into it on Facebook in the comments section of this video. One guy was like, you don't understand anything. Of course it doesn't exist. And somebody else was like, mate, what are you talking about? Of course it exists. You don't understand Freud. No, you don't understand Freud. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so they got into it. So um, here I am. Uh, I'm the, you know, I'm, am I the UN? I'm not the UN. But here I am being the UN and telling you guys, you're both right. You're both right. People in many fields have studied this, have written about it, have done memoirs on it, have written how-tos on it and everything else. And they've all come to the same conclusion right through it. Think about that. The cure is the same whether or not you think you have the affliction. You're right through it if you have it. You're right through it if you don't. But you know, who am I? I'm a guy in a car, right? So you don't believe me, maybe. Believe others. That's what I did. I went into research and here's what I found. If one sticks to a schedule and tries to write on a regular basis, something will eventually come, Jhumpa Lahiri. What I try to do is write, Maya Angelou. Do it or don't do it, from the last page of The War of Art by Stephen Pressfield. Do or do not. There is no try Yoda. If you're not going to believe Yoda, you're not going to believe me. But we're kind of saying the same thing. Just keep writing. So you're both right. So don't yell at each other on Facebook, you know what I mean? Like, Facebook.